goes there? A friend of the temple. Fluarak. The council's message was absolute. You're not welcome here. I must speak with the Grand Master. He's in session. They all are. Another day, perhaps. King Philip disagrees. Damn you, man. Why you're not rotting in a cell at this moment, I cannot fathom. Betrayed! Draw your swords, men! Defend the temple! Not you, brother. I have a different task for you. Come with me. Alright, what we gotta do? Jacquees. I gotta follow her. Come on. I don't remember this, man. This, I got this on PS3. Come on, how you run? The assassins are far older than Masia, my friend. Their anarchic delusions are virulent as the plague, less easily eradicated. We will not prevail this night, but if you make haste, we may yet save our order. What must I do? Go to the tower. Take the sword and the book. Hide them. They must not fall into the assassins' hands. Grandmaster, I will. All right, let me see. Uh, I'm not reading all that. Let's go.
Got the sword, buddy. Here we go. upon the temple I curse you curse you to the 13th generation of your blood you just be cursed consumed in flames of hunger and wrath thus came the age of true wisdom to a blistering close the Knights Templar once the proud shepherds of order Peace and illumination were no more. Yeah, let's get a sniffer running. If Abstergo pings us, pull me out. Okay. I have a visual. Hey there. This is probably disorienting, so I'll be brief. I'm Bishop, not my real name, obviously, but that's as much as you'll get today. Please listen carefully. Abstergo is using you, hijacking your neurons to help them sift through genetic memory data. These guys already have their fingers in countless corporations, governments, media outlets, and NGOs. But now, they want control over history itself. If that doesn't frighten you, it should. But we're here to stop them, and I need your help. Deacon, preload gene sequence uh, AD16, B13, I87. Yep, spooling it up. Last week, we gained access to a bank of unsequenced memories in Abstergo's Helix servers. Oh, see, this For game now, is weird, man. All of them got this little future stuff this with it. You understand our struggle. And after that, you can decide for yourself what comes next. We'll be waiting. my boy you wait just here I will return when this hand reaches the top that's forever not as long as all that and when I get back we'll see the fireworks and Arno no exploring hmm yes father I had just, it was like 90% and we was close to a 100% completion when I first got it. This was like 2009.
Je parie qu'il avale le site des épées. Regarde, attrapez-les. You're gonna get a soldier thrashing. Quickly, quickly. You can't steal one. Thief! Put that back! All right, you now! Damn it! What the hell's going on? Put that away now! What come on now? Make the, don't make this the game. Come on. See their faces when we stole those apples. <laughs> I'm Arno. Elise. I'm here with my father. So am I. He has important business with the king. What should we do now? Shh. Listen. Don't worry. They'll never think to look for us in here. It was my fault. I'm the one who took the apple. Let's see where they're going. Monsieur Franklin, I sincerely hope this unfortunate affair does not darken your opinion of our nation. Monsieur, if we judge nations by the character of their hey, leaders, father, we should all be called our Come here, girl. Now. Father?
hard, so you stoop to thieve it, you bastard! Calm down, Victor. I've only come for my watch. It's my watch. I want it fairly. Well, in a just world, Victor, I would agree with you, but this is not a just world. This is France. You're a dead man! Oh, step lightly there. You'll hurt yourself. <laughs> Just had a nice chat with your brother. You go. Fetch the marshals. Hold on a minute. Diable. I've got it, Victor. <laughs> <laughs> oh. I say. Sorry. <laughs> Pardon, madam. You can come to an understanding. Please excuse him, he's not housebroken. You're kidding. I'm pressing this circle button like a hundred times. I can't even read a watch. Come over here and say that. Uh, no. Get back here. Over there. I'm going to smash your skull in the face. Ah, yes. A wise man knows when to admit defeat, Victor. Hitting me. And where in God's name have you been? Ha! Huh. Got you now, you little shit! Just a little misunderstanding. Nothing to... Your master's arbor in a common criminal. In broad daylight, he broke into my home and stole my watch! Did he indeed? Well, I'm sure the Marshal C would be more than willing to sort this out. Sort what out, Olivier? Uh, a most serious accusation against your ward, sir. He robbed me. <laughs> of what, precisely? Wait for me in my library. Don't give me that look. Victor cheats when he plays Pharaoh. Everyone knows it. Arno? Who are you talking to? No one, monsieur. 
You'll be happy to learn I've persuaded Olivier to leave off calling the Marshalsea. Again. Je vous remercie, monsieur. What is this? The sixth time? The seventh? Perhaps a new hobby might be better for your health. Well, I find playing cards affords many opportunities for fresh air and exercise. <laughs> we'll talk about this later. I have business in town and must collect Elise before I can attend to it. Elise is here? Only for the night. She returns to Paris first thing tomorrow. She'll need an escort, won't she, with you so preoccupied? One of you running a mock is quite enough. Remain here and see if Olivier has any chores for you. I'm sure he does. What was that? Give my regards to Elise. All right, y'all, we got a story mode. We're going to start on this, and we're going to keep it moving, y'all. Peace out.